Yeah, so I just left or pick up bun mi dang hung in Las Vegas. So I ordered two of them. One of them is bun mi Hawaii and the other one is bun mi B name. They have pretty good reviews. So just want to give it a shot. I'm not sure why it's cold. How's the bun me? It's not much of meat. It's still decent, but I thought it was maybe colder. All right, let's try first bite. I'm gonna flip, flip it in half. Hmm. So. The size actually, you know, Vietnamese style, it's not like um, Americanized, but the bun mi is not hot. Mm. You have bu butter. Just a little of the pork belly. Or um, crispy pork. It's not hot. But it tastes good. Okay. Oh no. This is Bun Mi Bay. Name. Ooh. They have a share it pork and the name named Joan here. Let's try. Let's actually slip it up. Ooh. Ooh. Why do you have a cold style? It's supposed to be hot, isn't it? There's a lot of Halloween. Mm. So two of this are about fourteen dollars. So it's like six point five per bun mi. This is in Chinatown compared to Orange County. That's quite expensive. But the one in Orange County is actually bigger size and it tastes really delicious. Well, somewhere you cannot actually compare to, um, you know, Vietnamese food in Orange County because it's always top notch. Because there's a lot of Vietnamese people live there. But this is acceptable. Mm. This is quite interesting because I never see this. In any sandwich before the bun me, so this is the first time. Hmm. It's cold, but it tastes good. Just imagine when it's get hotter. I would rate in general will be. 7.5 out of 10. 
so I come back for the second time today for the bánh mì bò kho. So this is like a bib stew um, with the noodles, rice noodle. I would say this was okay. Uh, it's not something special and really outstanding. So I would rate this maybe seven out of ten.